hello everyone and welcome to the channel the error you can see on the screen my Dell laptop is not booting up it's saying checking media and even it's automatically going to scan the system so if your laptop is not booting up this video is for you I will show you how to fix this issue so let your system scan first as you can see here otherwise you can leave this windows as well escape key you need to press here you can see here so display is coming up that means that there is no issue with your ram so the issue could be the bios and hardware and the motherboard as well so we will test that as well now so our step number one will be the hardware diagnostic test so in my windows it's automatically running but let me show how to stop it once you stop it you need to press f12 key and if you are not seeing this screen shut down your laptop properly and then press f12 key continuously like this and you can see here the options diagnostic just press the enter key and let your window detect the issue automatically if any hardware issue you have so this hardware diagnostic test will show you the result so let's wait here so this is a step number one hardware diagnostic test now we will see the next step as well So let's continue it. Testing processor and its estimated time is left here. So somehow it is taking more time guys. So I need to cancel this now. And you have to make sure that so all the tests should be passed and once it is passed then we can go to the BIOS option now to see the boot priority this time you need to press F2 key on your keyboard this is F2 press like this now you can leave it once you see this so now this is the boot settings guys you need to go to under general setting then click on system information and let's click on boot sequence now and you can see here you need to tick this box windows boot manager and once you see this you need to click on that and click on view and you need to make sure that your hard drive is showing up here you can see this is my hard drive this should be showing up here and also you need to make sure that date and time should be correct here otherwise you can change the date and time as well and also boot sequence should be on the top if it is down like this you need to make it up and then click on apply save the custom setting click on ok and click on exit Now see if it boots or not otherwise we will troubleshoot next step. Now seems it is booting up you can see window is loading. So my issue has been fixed now with just setting up the priority. If your issue is still not resolved we will go to the next step. I have restarted the laptop again and I need to press F2 key you also need to press F2 key again once the laptop screen or system screen is black now you need to press like this continuously
now this time go to the system configuration expand that go to SATA operation and you can see here you can select AHCI if AHCI is already selected here you can select red on then you need to apply changes and exit and see if that fix the issue or not if still not go to drivers and make sure SATA and M2M all the boxes are ticked here and then click on apply and ok if nothing works for you guys so you need to click on restore the setting and this will restore all the BIOS setting BIOS default factory settings so choose one by one first choose the BIOS default first and then click on OK and click on OK and this will also fix your issue so after applying these methods guy I'm pretty sure your issue is fixed if there is no hardware issue so I hope this video helps you if yes then hit like subscribe and share so thank you thanks for watching